basically, there's like three categories. I don't know what I'm doing, to be honest, but I pretend I will. Okay. I pretend I know what I'm doing. So, first of all, it's words. So, like, different, okay. like, it's like terminology for British. Okay. Okay, first of all, do you know what a nonce is? Definitely heard that word before. I've heard it. My friend says it, but I don't. I don't know exactly. Try and like guess a meaning for it. I know. Don't. It's like a word you call people. Yeah. I feel like it's bad. I don't know why I feel like it's bad. Yeah, kind of. Is that like calling someone like a bitch? <laughs> no, like a pedophile. Oh. <laughs> That's so much worse than I thought. <laughs> you know what? That's a nice word, though. I like that better. <laughs> Okay, so the next one is, I think I used to say this all the time, a chav. Yeah. Yeah. Do you guys know what a chav is? Have you like seen them on yeah. TikTok? Yeah. Do you, do you think they're real? Oh yeah. They're real. I have a picture. Oh my god. <laughs> the fact that these roam around my town. These roam because it's like it's a whole other species. Same with the road men. Do you know what road men are? Yeah. They're like chavs, but men. Basically. Yeah. <laughs> Right, I have another picture. A few visual learners. <laughs> <laughs> These also roam around my town. Do you know what the term like peng means? Like or like leng? Like is if you ever said like oh yeah you're leng or like you're peng? No? Okay. No. That basically means that like you're really pretty. Oh. Yeah. Oh. But like basically the Roman and the Chav say it though. It's basically their way oh. of saying that you're- Oh, it's not good no more. Yeah, really so, good. <laughs> it's gone. <laughs> what about like Bunda? Like, you guys don't know Bunda? No. If someone says like, oh yeah, you got a fat Bunda. <laughs> it basically means that you have a big bum. <laughs> With the context, it made sense. <laughs> or like a fat batty. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. So if someone, if you ever come to the UK and someone's like, yo, you got a big fatty, no, big fatty, I mean a big fatty. <laughs> like, yo, you got a big fatty still, fam. That basically means, oh, hey, you got a big bum. I love this so far. Right, that's the end of the words category. Next is the foods. What foods would you associate the British? Fish and chips. Have you, got, have you ever had like fish and chips? Yeah. Have you? There's Beam. a street right down my street and they have like fish fries. Fish fries? Yeah, it's like Friday when you can't eat meat. Why does she look mortified? Fish fries. So like yeah. chips but with fish in it. Mm -hmm. What the hell? Oh my god. Do you know do you have like fish and chip like takeaway places? Like takeout? Yeah. Do you? I have one here. Oh, yeah, I, I have one where I live. <laughs> Did you ever get it? Yeah, I did. They oh. closed down recently to remodel and they just opened back again. It's really nice now, actually. I did not think that you'd have fish and chip takeouts over there. Okay, the closest <laughs> one to me is 40 minutes away. Do you know what a crump is? Do you guys, do you guys like not have these? What is the texture like? It's, like, what is like? It's like bread, but this is like, it's like fluffy bread, kind of. There's like loads of holes in. I don't really know how to describe it. I don't think I've ever seen those around. Right, if I say to you, do you know what bangers and mash is? Bangers and mash. I love the way they say words. <laughs> <laughs> so this is bangers and mash. This is like what we have. Oh! Think. Yeah, it's basically sausages and mash, but we call them bangers. So it's... We think we're fancy, so we have like a different name for it. And then, do you know what a roast dinner is? I've definitely heard of that. But it's technically like Thanksgiving dinner, but probably oh, okay. not as big. But we have it every week. I'd be fat if I lived over there. I'd <laughs> literally be obese at this point. <laughs> Makes sense. I don't really like it though, so it's... I don't have it. Roast dinner is kind of gross. Oh okay. And I asked what the the what's well, the brown thing like the I'm gonna guess that's meat or something. What's the brown thing in oh, the corner? The massive round thing. That, yeah. That is a Yorkshire pudding. You guys don't have that, I don't think. Oh, no, I don't know what that is. I don't. I've never had one. Yeah. This is really funny. You guys don't have Kinder Surprise eggs, do you? Not anymore. I used to get them all the time as kids. We have a different version now. We don't have the one where it's a chocolate egg. We have one where it's like a plastic egg and you open it and half yeah. of it has the candy, uh -huh. but it's different. I don't like it. We used to have the old ones and I used to get them from this little German shop and I'm so mad we lost them. I'm allergic to them, so I can't have them. <laughs> okay. 
Well, my biggest flex is that we still sell those. The only reason I'm coming over is for those. Those are my yeah. childhood growing up. Okay, right. The next one, which I'm actually really excited about, is the school. Because okay. U UK schools are like so bad compared to US schools, I think. <laughs> so, you guys, obviously, you have non-uniform, don't you? No, mine has a uniform. You oh yeah, you do have a uniform. I go to- me and Tempers have uniforms because we go to private schools. Private schools have Everyone uniforms. Everyone else's are fine. Private school, it's private school girl. Yeah, all public schools, we all have uniform. Every single school has uniform, which sucks. So I'm glad I'm back to school now. <laughs> oh yeah, you've like graduated, right? Yeah. Was we like we graduate at 16 and you guys like graduate at 18. 18. What? Okay, me and Sing were talking about this. How does grade point averages work? Do you know what a GPA is? Yeah. <laughs> it's like your it takes your grade that you've had either through your whole from starting school to ending high school for us or by each year that you take a class. It goes from 4.0 to 1.0 or lower, but I've never seen lower. It's like a grading system here that colleges use. So, I don't even know how to explain it. Wait, so you have to like do well in like every single year or like grade you're in? To pass. Right, like colleges, they have a certain like GP, like if you want to get into a college, some of them have certain GPAs that you have to have throughout high school. Right, and like extra, I think, I don't know, just for me at least, cr extracurricular activities can get your GPA up. Oh, we have- Mine doesn't that. have that. So we didn't have it. So you could be terrible for like all the, all the grades or all my years. And then you, it's just about the final year is, it's just your grades in the final year. See, I wish we had that. This is, I don't know if my letters are on. That's like a, that's like a this is my American jacket. Oh. Yeah, this is like my letterman jacket. And this one's for academics. And for my school, you can get one for sports, which is blue instead. So when you, okay, this is a question. So when you guys do like your tests or like your exams, is it multiple choice? Mine wasn't. Mine was all fill in the blank. Like, I had to write out the problems and work it out. Mine was multiple choice. It depends on all the teachers in that department and what they decide to do. Half of like my teachers don't do exams. Yeah, some exams are straight up projects. Half of my teachers, we don't do anything. We just do normal work until the end of the year and then we're done. Mm -hmm. But, um, oh yeah. <laughs> so, do you guys have, like, the big yellow buses? Yeah. <laughs> that is mad. And I take the bus. You take the big yellow I don't. Bus. I take the bus. So, okay, next one is the lockers. Like, do you guys, like, use your lockers a lot? I don't. We I have backpacks. to. Well, I wish. We have to, we have rules. We have to put our backpacks on the shelves. And we're not allowed to have our phones on us at all. A lot of us still do. We just put on Do Not Disturb and keep it in our waistband so they can't see it. Yeah, we can have our phones, like, out- I mean, some teachers make us, like, put our phones in, like, a phone caddy thing. But most teachers, we're allowed to, like, be on them during class. Yeah. But do you guys have, like, really big, like, cafeterias? Mine is- Zoe's so is huge. <laughs> mine is huge, hold on. I... Mine is, like, it's okay, but it wasn't- it was kind of, like, just a hole. I don't really mine know looks like a rectangle. And That's it's really small, because my school's in big. Look how big their freaking cafeteria is. Oh it's huge! That is like, that's proper like, US high school musical. <laughs> <laughs> do, you, do you guys like, like suddenly like start singing and like jump on the tables and like dance? We do karaoke a lot though. <laughs> really? <laughs> they bring out like the speaker up to the front of the cafeteria and people go up and like do karaoke. You actually do it? Like actually do it? I thought you were saying like your class just sings during class. I was like, oh yeah, my class does that a lot. We'll randomly no, like, remember a song. Like you actually? <laughs> that is so cool. Patchkeys. Who? Patchkeys. Patchkeys. Yeah. Like a dinner. No, it's it's not a dinner. It's it's not a meal. It's like a it's a single thing. Is it like a type of sweet? Yeah. Oh, it's a jam donut. <laughs> yeah. 